Hello, and this is the scene here in the great cathedral city of Paderborn. The venue is the Bentele Arena. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here. It's Estse Paderborn up against Borussia Mönchengladbach. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Great atmosphere here. The two sides, I'm sure, will set a quick tempo in this game. We get to watch for free. The players are chomping at the bit. I can't wait. The initial 11 today for the hosts. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield, a back four, the two full backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre backs. And here's how it looks for Borussia Mönchengladbach. The Swiss international, Jan Sommer, is the goalkeeper. Matthias Ginter plays with Nico Elvedi in central defence. And the striker of choice in this setup is Alassane Plea. And now they get the ball rolling. Sabini. Effective challenge. Alassane Plea. Nico Elvedi. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Lee? Well, every defender goes into the game not wanting three goals in three games to be the player you're playing against. And that's the case today. Giving the ball away. Florian Neuhaus. Nice looking pass. Oh, showing excellent vision and a goal 1 0 and what a fast start they've made to this game well here's the goal again and it's a great ball to put him through but then there's plenty to do from there he's hit it so well lots of pace lots of power and the keeper just can't react in time. Great strike. The opening goal of the game then. Tor for Mönchengladbach. Die Nummer 25. Rami Benzivaini. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Kramer. The ball with player. Moving it forward. No, high quality defending. And a throw in forthcoming. Lars Stindl. Florian Neuhaus. The ball with player. How can he take them on and beat them? Great block.
Over it comes. Able to deal with the threat. The delivery. Can they cover up? Able to close down the shot. Alassane Playa. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Sabini. Collins. On the ball, Denis Sabini. Oh, big chance. Takes the shot. And it goes. The leveller. Thrilling stuff here. Well, it's good build-up, and there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. So, a level contest, 1-1. One, one. Lars Stindl. Gladbach enjoying the bulk of possession here, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, you could be critical of the defending, but let's focus on the great play. Capped off with a superb, calm, calculated finish. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1, the current state of affairs. The number 32, Florian Neuhaus. Sean Lau. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Alassane Playa. Fruitful-looking attack. Kindle. Neuhaus. Really getting stuck in. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, you're right, he has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. And now they get the ball rolling. Now showing excellent vision. And a goal! 1-0, and what a fast start they've made to this game. On the ball, Denis Sabini. Oh, big chance. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Drama. The ball with player, Lars Stindl. On to Turam. 
Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Possession changes hands, the interception there. Lars Stindl. Alassane Player. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Went in strongly to win the ball. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Stefan Leiner. And that was a very fine read. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Looks promising this. Straightforward take. Bon Sebaini. Now with Stindl. Alassane Plea. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Florian Neuhaus. Hoffman. And he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Vasiliadis. On the ball, Denis Sabini. It did look on for them, but not to be. Smuggled away. Marcus Tuham. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. A matter of keeping his composure. But it can't get all the way through. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Sabini. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Hoffman. Terrific block. Stindl. Zakaria. Hoffman could be well that's how to hit them not quite accurate enough though Auswechslung bei Borussia Mönchengladbach vom Feld gegangen die Nummer 14 Alassane Player Neu dabei, die Nummer 36, Breen Embolo. Sean Lau. Collins. Inside the final five minutes now. We're getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. Has a go. Good defending to prevent the chance. Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. And time for the change now. Valentino 
Elvedi. On to Stindl. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. And that puts them in position. Oh, he saved it well. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser. Over it comes. Sean now. Vasiliadis. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time, and it's a victory for the visitors, Lee. Well, split by that one goal. That's how close the game was. Neither team deserved to lose, really. It was so tight. In the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Lee. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.